Welcome back to the show. Into ASEAN Calendar, we've got lots of important holidays to mark your dates with. Good Friday 2018. What is Good Friday? This year, Good Friday will fall on Friday, March 30th. In different traditions, the date is also known as Holy Friday, Great Friday, Black Friday, or Easter Friday. It marks the start of the Easter long weekend, which includes Easter Monday on April 2, 2018. The date changes every year as Easter Sunday must always fall on the next full moon after the spring equinox. Is Good Friday a bank holiday? Good news! Good Friday is a bank holiday, so for many people, it marks the beginning of their Easter weekend. Monday, April 2nd, is also a bank holiday, but not every work will give employees these two Easter dates off. Bank or public holidays do not have to be given to employees as paid leave. An employer can decide whether to include bank holidays as part of a worker's statuary leave. Why do we celebrate Good Friday? Good Friday is commemorated because the date marks the crucifixion of Jesus Christ and his death at Calvary. Accounts of the Gospel state that the Son of God was put to death after he was betrayed by Judas and sentenced to death. The date falls during Holy Week on the Friday before Easter Sunday and sometimes coincides with the Jewish celebration of Passover. Experts believe that the event has been coined Good Friday because the word good means pious or holy. First of April 2018, Easter Day. Easter Sunday is one of the most festive events among Christians worldwide. It commemorates Jesus Christ's resurrection from death as written in the Christian Bible. What do people do? Many Christians worldwide celebrate Easter with special church services, music, candlelight, flowers, and the ringing of church bells. Easter processions are held in some countries such as the Philippines and Spain. Many Christians view Easter as the greatest feast of the church year. It is a day of joy and celebration to commemorate that Jesus Christ is risen according to Christian belief. Many towns and villages in Italy have sacred dramas about the episodes of the Easter story. These are held in the pizzas on Easter day. Pastries called Corona di Nove are baked in the form of a crown. Other traditional foods include lamb and goat. Eastern Poland is celebrated with family meals that include ham, sausages, salads, babka, a Polish cake, and mazurka, or sweet cakes filled with nuts, fruit, and honey. Although Easter maintains great religious significance, many children in countries such as Australia, Canada, the United States, and the United Kingdom think of it as a time to get new spring clothes, to decorate eggs, and to participate in Easter egg hunts where eggs are hidden by the Easter Bunny. Some children receive Easter baskets full of candy, snacks, and presents around this time of the year. Public Life Easter Sunday falls on a Sunday, which is a non-working day in countries such as Australia, Canada, the United Kingdom, and the United States. Government officials and schools are closed in countries where Sunday is a non-working day and business activities are limited. In countries where Sunday is a non-working day, transport schedules may be limited or operate on a different schedule to that of the working week. So those intending on traveling via public transport may need to check their schedules ahead of time. Background Many Christians celebrate Easter Sunday as the day of Jesus Christ's resurrection, which is written in the New Testament of the Christian Bible. According to the Gospel of John in the New Testament, Mary Magdalene came to the tomb where Jesus was buried and found it empty. An angel had told her that Jesus had ridden. Christians worldwide have celebrated Easter for centuries. However, the roots of the Easter holiday's traditions and activities can be traced back to pagan celebrations. The name Easter is believed to come from Eostera, the goddess of rebirth. In early times, the Feast of Eurostera celebrated Earth's resurrection and rebirth. Strict Puritans would have nothing to do with Easter. It was merely a human institution in the past. 
Charles I, King of England, declared the day as scriptural as Sunday in 1647, but Parliament contradicted him in print and abolished it with other church festivals. The Easter date depends on the ecclesiastical approximation of the March equinox. In 325 CE, the Council of Nicaea decided that the Easter date would be the first Sunday after the full moon occurring on or after the March equinox. Easter is therefore delayed one week if the full moon is on Sunday, which lessens the likelihood of it falling on the same day as the Jewish Passover. Eastern Orthodox churches in many countries, such as Greece, still figure their Easter date based on the Julian calendar. Symbols. Easter eggs and Easter bunny are both fertility symbols, holdovers from the feast of Eostera. Other symbolic parallels include the pagan joy in the rising sun of spring, which coincides with Christians' joy in the rising sun of God, and the lighting of candles in churches, which corresponds to the pagan bonfires. The symbol of the cross and images of Jesus Christ through paintings or statues are remembered on Easter Day. April 2018, April Fool's Day. If you see footage of penguins flying, check your calendar. There's a good chance it's April 1st. The first day of April each year is celebrated as April Fool's Day, sometimes called All Fool's Day. Although it's not a legal holiday, April Fool's Day is celebrated all around the world as a day filled with practical jokes and general silliness. You may want to be a little more cautious or skeptical on April 1st, since family members, friends, neighbors, co-workers, and even teachers may try to tickle your funny bone with a practical joke or a hoax of some kind. So, how did this tradition of craziness begin? In truth, it remains a mystery. Although there are many theories about how April Fool's Day got started. Some believe the first association between April 1st and playing tricks can be found in Geoffrey Chaucer's *The Canterbury Tales* from 1392. Chakri Memorial Day or Chakri Day. When is Chakri Memorial Day? Chakri Memorial Day is a national holiday in Thailand observed on the 6th of April. If April 6th falls on a weekend. The following Monday will be taken as a substitute holiday. The history of Chakri Memorial Day, officially known as King Buddha Yatva Jalalok, the Great Day, and Chakri Dynasty Memorial Day, Chakri Day commemorates the establishment of the Chakri Dynasty by Prabhu Buddha Yatva Jalalok or Rama the First in 1782. One of King Rama's first acts was to make Krung Thae or modern-day Bangkok the capital of Siam. Chakri Day commemorates the coronation of Rama the First, but it's also a day for people of Thailand to recognize the contributions of all the kings in the dynasty. The current and tenth king, or King Rama the Tenth of the dynasty, is King Wajiralongkorn, who succeeded his father, King Pumipun Adunyadet, who died on October 2016. How is Chakri Memorial Day celebrated? The king, accompanied by other members of the royal household, presides over the religious ceremonies held at the royal chapel. He pays respects to his predecessors at the royal pantheon, which contains life-size statues of the first eight kings of the Chakri dynasty. And he'll lay a wreath at the statue of King Rama the First at the memorial bridge. As this holiday always falls a few days before the three-day Songkran festival. It's also an opportunity for people to travel in preparation for the festivities. The Day of Valor marks the greatness of Filipino fighters during World War II. It's marked on or around April 9th in the Philippines each year. What do people do? This holiday, also known as Ara in Kagitingan, is a non-working holiday. That's also part of a long weekend in the Philippines. World War II veterans parade in different cities in the Philippines on this day. There are small parades in various localities in the Philippines, but this holiday's main highlight occurs when the country's president gives a speech at Mount Samak Shrine in the Bataan Province to commemorate the heroism of the Filipinos and American troops during World War II. Public life. 
The Day of Valor is a regular holiday in the Philippines and occurs on around April 9th. A lot of the streets, as a result, are closed, and public transportation routes may be redirected to give way for parades. Malls and other leisure activities remain open, and most people may go to these places and use this day as a family day. Background. This Day of Valor commemorates the heroism of Filipinos and American soldiers when the Japanese occupied the Philippines during World War II. The Major General Edward P. King of the United States Army was forced to surrender more than 76,000 Filipinos, Chinese, and American soldiers to the Japanese at dawn on April 9, 1942. The soldiers were forced to take a 90-mile hike to Camp O'Donnell in San Fernando. Thousands of prisoners died during the hike. It was called the Batan Death March. They died because of starvation, dehydration, and diseases before reaching the camp. Despite the trials of defeat, the captured soldiers stood strong, and heroes emerged from the event. The surrender of Batan hastened the fall of Corregidor. However, without this stand, the Japanese might have quickly overrun all of the U.S. bases in the Pacific. Batan forced them to slow down, giving the Allies valuable time to prepare for the conflicts, such as the Battle of the Coral Sea and the Battle of Midway, which followed closely thereafter. American and Filipino Liberation Forces eventually retook the Batan Peninsula on February 8, 1945. The Day of Valor was a national observance until a letter of instruction, number 1087, dated on November 26, 1980, made the Day of Valor a national public holiday to honor the people who helped bring democracy and freedom in the Philippines during World War II. Executive Order No. 203, dated June 30, 1987, further proclaimed April 9th as the Day of Valor, a tribute to the heroes of Batan, Corregidor, and Besan. Those are the events to mark your calendars with. With that said, we're going to take a short break and we'll be back soon. Stay with us.